Hey guys, this is Apple Gamer 247. I'm here to do an app review today of Flick Fishing for the iPod Touch and iPhone. This is an app in the App Store for 99 cents. That so are Max. I'm fishing. Um, what it basically uses is the accelerometer and the iPod Touch as long as the touch screen to unwheel the fish in with the touch screen and cast your line out with the um, iPod Touch accelerometer. So I'm going to demonstrate all this in the gameplay. So um, let's start the app up. And as you can see, the icon is right here next to LD Elet. Um, it's um, a fish getting ready to hook down to a line, so I'm gonna open it up. This is the main loading screen. Now, for a fishing game, um, the load times are pretty long, in my opinion. And the main title screen doesn't look like it's a fishing game. It looks like it's a um, a crappy version of it. So this is the main title screen. You get you get flick fish and sports. At the top here, and it says new game, help and options, photo album, and village shop. So we're gonna start a new game. Sorry about the lights going shaky. Um, then you're gonna hit go fishing. Then y'all, you get these little bobbers. They're floating around the map. You can tap on the bobber to start. And this is the um down here is the difficulty of the fish. And the fish you need to catch. So in this case, I have to catch a catfish. Let's hit start fishing. And this is when the accelerometer kicks in. It. it says, flick forward to cast line. So I'm going to try to do this on camera. So you do that a few times. And now you wait for the bobber to float. And then when the bottle floats, it says wheel and sorry guys, the off my touch is still off. And as you can see, I caught a catfish. Then and then at the bottom, after you see how many pounds it is, um, you can hit release. Then you gotta do it again. Now uh, again, you gotta wait for the bobber to float. And the sound effects in the game um, sort of implement the fish and you get the real line casting sound and the real fish moving. So I just caught fish. I caught a catfish that was 7.2, 7.25 pounds again, so I hit release. I'm gonna try to cast this forward on camera. So, sorry guys if you can't watch it too well. But, um, look for the bobber. Come on. As you can see, the bobber's coming up. And again, I caught a, f a catfish, but this one was a little, um, smaller. So, this basically, all you do is catch the fish. I'll show you some more screens. Wait for the bobber. Yeah. Caught our fish. This one was a little bigger than the last one. So this is basically all you do is you pass and you fish. Now, um, if you want to be, like, all competitive, there is an online thing that, um, once you get started in it, um, the more fish you catch, the, um, the, you get points. But, and this one was a roach. That, it, that wasn't a catfish. And this was 58 ounces. I'm gonna do one more screen. Um, problems I have with the app, um, basically the accelerometer is slow, but I, that's the, um, iPod, not the app. Um, waiting for the bobber can take, um, matter of minutes, uh, up to 10 minutes sometimes. Um, you're, you guys are lucky that the, um, bobbers are coming up real fast. Um, I mainly bought this because, uh, Wii Gamer 356 wanted a fishing game, and I said, what the hell, can't hurt. 
So this is basically I'm doing this um, app review. So again, as you can see, it takes a long time for it to load. So I'm just gonna restart my line. Here we go. catfish again so that's basically it guys if you want to see more um, app reviews that you guys want to see please please let me know what app you want and I'll definitely download it it's a pay if it's a paid app um, if you want to sponsor it um, just send me a message and we can work out the uh, details and I will see you guys in my next video bye